so I never do hair on this channel. It's honestly because I'm really embarrassed about how thin and dry my hair is. So normally I just kind of don't don't have anything to do with it. Don't have any I don't have anything to do with it, but I'm gonna be I just got the girl, can you learn how to talk please before you hit record? I got these the just got these Irresistible Me hair extensions and I've been hearing about Irresistible Me for a while and I've been admiring their hair extensions from a distance um but I really wanted to try them so they reached out and were like do you want to try one of our sets and I was like absolutely and let me just say right off the bat I haven't even opened it yet see it's like sealed right here but um the bottom comes with a tester. This is the tester one, which the match. Do you see this? I'm like, what hair extension? Um, but I got an original set. It was number six chocolate and it was too light. It was like two shades too light. And I was really stressed and I felt really bad because I didn't want to be annoying and be like, um, like it doesn't match. Like I didn't want to be a Karen about it, but I, it just didn't look good, but luckily the, re the exchange thing, because even on here, it says like, um, color match guarantees the second thing, girl, it was the easiest thing ever to literally ship them back and then get a new set. And the new set came literally so quick, like within like four days, it was crazy. But basically what I was trying to say is like the, ex I already know the exchange, process for this company is already amazing and I definitely don't like I feel I feel so much more comfortable ordering from them knowing that if it wasn't a good match it the exchange process is just so easy so I wanted to mention that as well cute okay irresistible me and it's just like I'm cute. I love this I'm definitely gonna like probably store them in here oh do you see this this is more hair than i have on my whole head like and then it came with like an extra came with an extra one too this is like a full wig and it's so soft and like i i, I really feel like the color matches really well so this isn't a tutorial by the way or like a how i clip my hair extensions in this is kind of just like a first reaction because I'm not that talented at doing hair. I am so just speechless. This is just one, that one big clip that I just showed in the last clip. This is just that one clipped in. <laughs> like, okay, irresistible me, you didn't have to bother off that hard. I just don't have words right now. Like, do you see this hair? This is my hair. This looks like too good for something I could do. Like, <laughs> I need to stand, I need to stand up and show the inches. You guys, it was 104 degrees today in Florida. This hair should not, I am so obsessed right now. <sighs> I feel so pretty though, like just to be fully honest, I, I didn't know what to expect because I like don't like my natural hair that much at all. And this made me like love it. Like I look so good right now like I'm like so shocked I look like I like went to the salon or something I cannot believe this like I I want to like sleep in these and never take them out oh my gosh these are easily the best hair extensions I've ever put in my head and I'm not even just saying that like I've been reviewing hair extensions and buying them and all that for since what 2013 
these just changed the game like for real i can't stop looking at myself in the viewfinder so i'm giving a huge shout out to irresistible me hair like holy crap i am not getting sponsored to like do any of this but i am just genuinely so shocked like the hair is just speaking for, for itself i wish you could literally touch it it is so smooth and just silky like i just cannot right now i cannot wait to wear this out and just live my life i need to go to miami in this like Hi guys, it's been a minute. It's been a mom, if you will. The last clip you saw, I uh, just installed my hair extensions, but it's it was like 104 degrees out today, so I plan on wearing them to a wedding next month, so I'm kind of trying to not really wear them that much. But anyway, I've been kind of not feeling the best because it's coming up a year of my mom passing away so i have not really been vlogging or doing much but yeah i'm just starting to kind of get back into the swing of things so yeah yeah i love this camera so much it's like just i need to just start vlogging with it more everywhere i go it's, I really want to get back into the swing of vlogging. It's just kind of hard because if you've vlogged before, then you know it's kind of hard to stop what you're doing and, like, take out a camera. Right, Finny? Yeah. That was cute, Finn. Do a trick. Lay down, roll over. Do you want to show them your Aldi boxes? So... Finn is obsessed with these yogurt boxes from Aldi. Um, he just loves, like, look. <laughs> look at him. Oh, he's the cutest. So, yeah, he has two because I'm not going to take them away. Check it out, guys. Special delivery. You got a special kitty delivery. Finny, say hi. Say hi. Say hi, Finny. <laughs> <laughs> He's so cute. Oof. You're not about to take over my vlog. What's up, guys? This is the uh, Tristy True vlog. It's our anniversary, you guys. It is. So we're taking a shot. We, we just went out to a restaurant near us. And it's honestly one of my favorite restaurants. I got a taco salad, so I am living my life. I wish I had somewhere to put you guys while I take my makeup off. I know makeup wipes are so bad for you, but I just don't care right now. I don't care. Also, I thrifted this shirt for 50 cents. And I'm honestly really proud of it. So, it says staff on the back, but it's just like a sleepy t-shirt. So, yeah. Also, really fun fact, these, I don't even know what they are, but they're like flowers that don't require water. My cousin's girlfriend gave me these in November last year, and I'm so obsessed that you just don't water them, and they just stay like this forever. Um, I don't know why I showed you that, but yeah. So yeah, I'm going to take my makeup off real quick. I'll be right back. Girl, girl. Oh my God, it won't shut off. It won't. Makeup is off. Um, there is literally no better feeling than taking your makeup off. Also, I said this, if you're wondering what this is, I play on my laptop and I use this to like put in between my laptop and my legs in case you're wondering. Anyway. Um, and also my cat, like, knocked the curtain and curtain rod off, so. Girl, I didn't feel like bringing out a ladder and a hammer and nails and redoing it. So, you're just gonna have to live, alright? 
Um, but <laughs> anyway, it's just bothering. It's bothering me personally because I really like the curtains and I just don't like the sunlight blasting in. But what was I going to say? Something else that's exciting. So I said I was saving my hair extensions for a wedding in September. Um, but I also might be going on a cruise in September, which is like insane because cruises and just the ocean are not cruises but the ocean is one of my biggest fears and so the fact that like i'm gonna go on a cruise it's to turks and caicos in the bahamas so i'm like i can get over it if i'm going there but um i'm really excited i'm really nervous but i'm mainly doing it because my best friend I'm pretty sure that's where her honeymoon is, but she really wants me and T to go as well. So I think we're going to go. But I'm like stoked but nervous because I've never been on a cruise. And I see TikToks and I'm just like, ah. But I think it'll be exciting. But I have like one dress, like a cruise dress. So I'm going to have to start shopping now. And... Yeah, what else do I have to say? I've just, like I said earlier, I've been really down in the dumps, really sad, and just trying to figure things out. Um, I don't like talking about it, but like the whole thing with my mom still really just like messes me up. I want, messes me up, but like fucks me up. I just didn't want to say that, but. Yeah, every night before bed, like, lately I've been going to bed at, like, 5, 6, 7 a.m. Because I just, like, can't stop thinking about it. And I think about it every night, and it just really keeps me awake. And, yeah, it's not fun. So, I mean, if you're, if you're watching this and you lost a parent or anyone that's, like, your best friend or like your main person then you definitely kind of know what I'm going through but it's just hard and I feel like people really don't talk about like the afterwards like I, like obviously the right around when you lose someone important to you it's really devastating but I feel like talking about what happens like a year later or um, like two months after like, no one talks about how that's almost harder. I guess some people do. But I guess I just didn't realize how it stays, if not gets harder, than, like, when you first find out that you lost someone. So, I don't want to get into it too much because it just really depresses me. Plus, it looks like the sun's going down. Um, but, yeah, I think I'm just going to leave this vlog here. Um, I'm going to try and go to bed earlier because like I said, it, going to bed that late is not cute. I do want to vlog. Like, how much? Oh, I have eight hours of recording time on here. I'm going to use all eight hours. Um, but yeah, I think tomorrow I'm going to go thrifting because I really want to get stuff for my beauty room. And I want to get like a couch or like some kind of seat. So I will take you guys along for that. Um, and yeah, thank you guys for watching. Follow me on TikTok and Instagram. Link down below. So annoying. And yeah, Finn, do you want to say anything? <laughs> you want to say anything, Finn? Huh? He's just loafing. But yeah, I love you guys. I'll talk to you in the next video. Bye.